Good day, everybody. Welcome back. This is Kevin Hogan, author of The Psychology of Persuasion and 21 Other Books. That number's starting to get up there. Hey, today, hypnotic language to inoculate your customer or that person or your friend to your competitor's arguments against doing business with you or going out with you or working with you. Ooh, how are you going to do that? In other words, you know that that person over there is going to tell your friend that their decision to do something with you was wrong. Whether it's doing business with you, going out with you on a date, or hanging out with you in general, you know that that person over there is going to try to talk them out of it. What are you going to do? The seven piece process. So I know that that person over there is going to tell this person over here not to do business with you. So what we're going to do is we're going to inoculate this person against their poison. And the way that you do it is this. You're going to say, John or Jane, you and I both know, now wait a second, that's you and I both know. We're on the same team, right? We're on the same team and we both know. It's obvious, right? It's obvious obviously okay so you and I both know this is the right decision boom this is the right decision you don't actually have to say it quite like that right say you obviously know that this is the smart thing to do that's how I would say it right this is the obvious thing to do any idiot would do this right okay so you you and I both know we're on the same team that this is obviously the smart thing to do right there's two pieces right Bing, bing. So now we're on the same team and it makes it obvious that this is the right decision. That's number two. And then three, because we know all the facts or because we've actually thought about it or because we've actually taken the time to figure it out. And this goofball over here is going to come and he's going to, right? This is where you're going with this, right? So you establish the fact that you're on the same team. Then we accomplish the goal of making sure the person knows that this is the right decision or the right way to go or the right thing to do or the smartest thing to do or that somebody else's idea, even better, is the dumb, stupid way to go. The idiots over there, that's beautiful because they've now become out group and you guys are in group. That's nice. So what are you going to say now? We're now putting it into their mind. So what are you going to say? They are going to have to verbalize words to that person who's poison over there. There's your dragon. They're toxic. That's the dragon who's going to screw everything up over here. So what will you say? This is one of the few times that you have to use the word you attached to an action. Okay. So what will you say, that piece, and then to those people, actually it's that person, Hopefully it's just that person. Could be more than one. Might have to come up with more than one situation here. But hopefully it's the one person. To those people who wonder why. So you now have it clear in this person's head that she is going to have to talk to him because he's wondering why. So, so what will you say to those who wonder why you're going this route? Now this is where you can point to you, you can point to your product, you can point to your service, your billboard, whatever it is, it makes it clear. But you're going this route, this way, this direction, this course in life, and then try to change your mind. And if you want, you can tag on, and how do you feel about that anyway? at the end of that. So one more time, the hypnotic inoculation is a pretty cool, simple scripting process here. Basically, you know that person is going to try to convince this person not to do business with you, to buy you, to buy your product, to buy your service, to do something with you. They're going to try and talk that person out of it. And you are simply going to go, you and I both know that this is the right decision because you and I have all the facts. So what are you going to say when they start to wonder why you're going this route and then they're going to try to change your mind. And how do you feel about that anyway? You have now inoculated that person because they will be compelled to tell you what they're now going to tell that person, which is almost, almost always something like, I don't care what they think. Yeah, but what are you going to say to them? You have to do that. Okay, you have to get the words to come out now because you need them to come out next week, tomorrow, next Tuesday afternoon. They'll say, well, I'll just tell him that he's an idiot. Good enough for me. That works great. You've now accomplished the inoculation hypnotically in an absolutely beautiful pattern that you can use for almost any context where you need to inoculate that person from that person's poison. Have a great day. I'll see you here next time.